Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today I'm going to show you how to create some dotted pattern animation. In other words, how to do some dotted transition. First thing, click on the new composition here. I'm going to type in dots. I'm going to make it 1080 by 1080. Four seconds, click OK. Here is the circle. Where's the rectangle? Select the ellipse tool. Press and hold shift. I'm going to make a circle. You can also recolor it here. I'm going to make it white. All right. I'm going to place this right here somewhere. And I'm going to go here. Where's the content? And click where's the add and select the repeater. So as you can see, it's created like two more copies. It starts to repeat. Go to the repeater one. And here we got the copies. I'm going to increase the copies. I don't know, somewhere around 15. And I'm going to go to the transition repeater one and we got the scale right here. As you can see, if I decrease or increase, it is going to scale. So this biggest circle is not getting animated. As you can see, it remains the same. So I'm going to need to push this circle out. I'm going to type in now 100. OK, let's go up and I'm going to add another repeater. Go to the repeater two, and we're gonna go to the transform repeater two. And we got here the position, I gonna type in here zero. And here in the other one, I gonna type in 100. So I'm gonna go here, where's the repeater two, where's the copies, I gonna increase the copies. So I'm gonna go back up and search for the skill. This is the skill. So if, let's check it out. Perfect. So I'm gonna pull this all the way down until they disappear, it should be on zero. I'm gonna type in zero. I'm gonna click on the stopwatch. So now the animation starts here. I'm gonna go to the tuned second and increase this all the way until it's gonna be full white. So this is like 123%. And I'm gonna go all the way to the fourth second and I'm gonna type in zero again. And I'm gonna push this all the way out and select all of these keyframes, right click, go to keyframe assist and select easy ease. Click play and now you got the animation going on. Look at that. Now if you want to make it multicolored, I'm also going to of course change the fill. I'm going to make yellow and I'm going to create here a new composition, type in blue. By the way, I'm going to rename this dots yellow. And I'm going to double click on the yellow where I was. I'm going to select the shape shape layer, press control C, double click on the blue and click here and press control V. So it's going to copy paste, you know, the animation. And we're going to change the color here to blue. I'm going to create a new composition and this is going to be final comp. Click OK. What I'm going to do is select the blue, select the yellow, just drag it in there. Okay, so as you can see, nothing is going on. Everything is blue right now, but I'm gonna delay the blue. I'm gonna do it with 10 frames. If I increase it, as you can see, you got the blue inside and the yellow outside. And mainly this was it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. And also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye-bye.